ついに今日が来ましたボイスメールとコンプレットのジャパンツアー in 名古屋でラディックスでやります先ほどリハやったんですけどボイスメールもジャケンもダンサーもみんなバイブスやばかったですで今ホテルに戻ったんでこれからマイティートグズ TV もホテルに乗り込んでインタビューをボイスメールにあんなことやこんなことを聞いてみようと思いますそれでは行きましょうよみやせなダンフィノーディスクレイよいどんのりさケビンアンティゲダウェーバイスメールライプヨーレプレゼンティンライフパンマイティトークス TV ドクスワチッツ Move. When me say dance, me no mean if you stand up in a dance. Dance, 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 I'll go on them for no, this is Craig. Yeah, you don't know this, I'm Kevin. And together we're Vice Mayor. Man. <laughs> uh, well, the group originally formed in 1999. It was five of us. You know, three years after, two, two other members decided to leave to venture on other stuff. You know, and sadly, 2010, we lost another member. You know, so it's now me and Kevin. So it has been, it has been a journey. You know, it was just a local audition L. Kevin knew the other two that wasn't there, that's not there anymore. And they they went to just audition. Kevin not even went to audition, he just take them there. You get me? And it so happened that they were looking for a group. I went separate, you know, they picked Kevin and Robert and Leon and then me separate and I picked O'Neill. And that was the former vice mail in nineteen ninety nine and we're here today they you and Kevin. Mm -hmm. Still carrying the legacy and the journey. Not, um, oh. um, I think, well, I, think, I mean, we each have our separate inspirations in music. I mean, um, for me personally, I, I used to just I used to love a lot of dance and like, reggae music coming up. Um, other, other from the radio, where the radio used to play a lot of R&B and more international music. Um, in the household, that is. But when we saw Teeth out, and I used to be dance and reggae. And at that time, I mean, for me, the inspiration was Sanchez, you know, Wayne Wanda. Um, as DJs, we used to be, um, you know, Terra Fabulous, you know, um, the, the stitches of Papa Sands coming up, Shabba Ramps, you know, those were, the, those were to me the inspiration. Well, I mean, for me, like Kevin said, local radio used to play a lot of overseas music, you know, was influenced a, a lot by RB and gospel. You know, but like like him saying, the dancehall circuit. You know, I had a brother who uh, who is a part of music. He's still a part of reggae dancehall. You know, and the, he he was a part of a crew named Scare Them Crew. You know, Scare Them was basically my big inspiration as an in, injection into reggae dancehall. You know, inspiration apart from that is like Shaba. You know, the regular Bujo, You know, Berries. We in one like like likewise, and you know the bean is on the bounty. You know, once you used to the dance hall, and you be a part of dance hall, trust me, you you are you are inspiration to us as 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 a, um, a super group. You know, who is doing like a dance hall. So those are some of our inspiration. Okay, okay. okay. Um, I think one of the biggest things <coughs> that stand out in the brain. Today is Yokohama Fest in Japan. You know what I mean? Um, <coughs> excuse me. Um, that memory will always be on your brain because you know, when I stepped on that stage, it was like 40 some thousand people. You know what I mean? And they were all jumping to voice me a performance. So that memory is 
planted right at the forefront of your brain. The brain you know? Yeah, I think I will support that also. You come my fest, you know, I have to big up Mighty Crown. Yeah, man. For well, inv inviting Vice Mayor, you know, I have to say rest in peace for me because that was one of his favorite shows also. So, yeah. that's one of Vice Mayor's biggest memory. You come my fest. Yeah. Well, Bogle yeah. is dance hall, greatest, greatest dancer, yeah. you know. Dance hall, God, dance hall, Jesus, yeah, Bogle, dance hall. Bogle, Bogle has always been in dance hall yeah. in the streets, you know, but we really got put on to Bogle to, to choose Danny Champion, you know, I have to say big up to Danny Champion. Yeah, he's a producer of Ready, ready to Time, man, ready, ready to, to Party. party. Danny yeah, Champion. Yeah. Danny. Yeah. Danny. Danny. Danny Champion. Oh. You know, we met we met, we met Danny Champion when the group put together in 1999 down by Grafton Studio. And, you know, we got some work done and then we moved forward and then we link up back in 2003. Um, 2003, 2004. And Danny introduced an idea to do a song with a dancer. And Danny and Bogo was very close. You know, so the song put together and we and Bogo start for every night. You know, so... We meet, we meet Bogle officially through Danny Champagne, but Bogle has always been in dance. Yo, yeah, it keeps. Let's go. Big up our dancer. Hey, yo, this is Gambrett from Japan. Alongside Boys Fair, Let's Jamaica. Go. This is Block J.A. to J.A. Yeah. Hey, dance to almost one Dance to almost one This is the last game. to the Way up there, way up there, like, like a real city of Buffy Way up there, way up there, the part of Jamaica watch me Way up there, way up there, like we act like, like we're so gonna be gay Way up there, way up there Um, <clears throat> you know it was just a regular conversation between, you know, me and Cambred Um, we introduced the idea to him Um, Cambred said He's going to try and try he did, you know. Mm -hmm. And I must say enough respect to Cambred for yeah, taking the time and put the tour together. You know, I am having fun. I hope he's having fun. Because <laughs> mm -hmm. it's one of it's it we've been touring Japan for a while and this is one of our favorite times in terms of like having fun and getting to experience a lot more of Japan. Yeah, you know, so the basic the basic the basic conversation went you know, we'd love if we could put on a tour. Why not? Why not put on a tour advice me? And you know, he tried, and this is what this is the result. You know, we're here in Japan. We have done six shows so far. Six amazing shows. The fans have been pleased. You know, they're excited, you know, they're happy to see voice mail and they love what this is going on. So big up to Jagan and you know, aka Cambridge. Mm -hmm. Way up there. Oh. Yeah, I, I mean that's basically where the relationship started with Cambridge. Um, when he posted a um a Japan, a, a video, Japan video of, of him doing doing a choreograph move to step, which is one of our biggest songs in Jamaica right now. Yeah. And that's basically how the relationship yeah, started. Yeah, honestly, you know? honestly, yeah, that's <laughs> exactly how I got got introduced to Conrad, and then you know I get to meet him in person, and it was half a chain. I just think this Japanese guy is just neat, you know, <laughs> dancing all these great Jamaican move, latest Jamaican mm -hmm. dance move, you know. So everything really started from there, like. Kevin and Cambridge here. so yeah from that from Let's Dance now way up the tour yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, definitely we we'll definitely see a, a, um, a difference this time around um, on the Japanese scene because this time around we have I think we have more dancers now more than you know in the past in the past when we used to tour it used to be a lot of fans you know what I mean just genuine fans that love the music you know, so whatever we sing, you know, they love, but they realize now that you have a lot of participants in the dance, when you're performing, you see people doing the dance moves, you know what I mean, you see people, you see the, you see the, um, the audience doing moves to videos, to choreograph moves that are in the videos, and you say, oh, you know what I mean, so definitely the scene now is a little bit more, you know, vibrant because of, because you have more dance, because it kind of reminds you of Jamaican dance on the streets, you know what I mean, so, 
definitely love love the vibe. <coughs> yeah, I mean, right now it's it turn up. That's how I can say, way up, way up, way up. But like Kevin said, we don't only have fans now, we have dancers. So the fans plus dancers, fans who are dancers and all of that collectively come together. Dancers are seen in Japan, turn up. Yeah. <laughs> You are him, come as soon as you feel the girl name Yeah, we need to represent it And let's go Your name is song, but me write more of me sing about it If I want to think, me know me girl live without it Damn, your body good, me still a thing about it That love in there, you know me can't forget it Baby, the way you put that body on me, I'm going to call it a day From me get the love, you know I'm telling me well, I mean, me personally, listen to Craig speaking, you know, we just have to say to the Japanese fans, you know, Arigato Gazaimas, you know, thanks for the love and support, keep supporting reggae dance art, you know, if you love to dance, dance. If you love to promote, promote but whatever you do, keep doing it, keep having fun. As voicemail, as long as you're doing music, we're going to have fun. Um, just basically to reiterate what Craig said, I mean, I get to much stuff to all Japanese fans, you know, I mean, all support of reggae and dance and music, no matter who, what artists you like, you know, I mean, as long as you support the music and the movement. Um, Life is today, not tomorrow, you know what I mean? So do whatever you're doing today, don't put it out to tomorrow. You know what I mean? Whatever goals you have, whatever inspiration you have, just go for it. You know, grab it with two hands, you know what I mean? And make sure you perfect it to, to the best of your abilities, you know what I mean? Continue to love the music, continue to love life, continue to love voice, you know? Love you. Aish Thomas. Well, I mean, the target right now is, is to make voicemail a world, you know what I mean, and not just, you know, because we, we master stuff, conquered certain territories in dance and, and music and, you know, in general, you know, but we want to, to make that global mark, you know, around the world, you know, that whenever you talk about performers, whenever you talk about artists, you have to mention voicemail. You know what I mean? So definitely that's that's the, the, the aim. Yeah, I mean <clears throat> um, to add to all of that, you know, definitely support what Kevin's saying, you know, to make Vice Meal a world brand. Not just a local brand, but a world brand. You know, and years and years and years and years and years to come. Like how we as Vice Meal can sit and watch the Bob Marley's, the Peter Tash, Dennis Brown and all those people, great people. We want to know after leaving this music scene, we still have fans and youngsters growing up watching what Vice Me used to do. So from now, as Kevin said, live for today, at the present moment, Vice Me, our target is to be a world brand. Dance our scene is dance our scene in Jamaica. I mean, you have Conbert can tell you when he comes to Jamaica, it's a million party per night. You know what I mean? So there is never a dull moment in dance hall. You know what I mean? Um, I mean, you have a little bit more influction of um, infusion of, of overseas music. Um, whereas in, 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 in the term of hip hop, I mean, a lot, of, a, lot of, a lot more hip hop music being played. You know what I mean? But the dance scene in Jamaica, there's never a dull moment. You know what I mean? And at any given night, there is um, at least three, four parties. You know what I mean? Just like all the Japanese, I, I realize in Japan now, you have party that goes up until 7 o'clock in the morning. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? That is Jamaica. You know what I mean? Um, other than the fact that there are a lot less, a lot more or less stage shows where you have live performances. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's the only thing lacking in dance right now to me. You know what I mean? Um, the, 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 the shows have actually, you know, without up a little bit, there's probably three or four major shows than where the you United know, States dance hall is performing um, for the year, really. And, you know, that's the only damper. Yeah, dance hall I, I mean, dance hall, <laughs> like Kevin said, dance hall is dance hall. Dance hall is 
spontaneous dance hall is fun you know whenever you hear them say we're <clears throat> dance hall and mashup dance hall can't mash up because every day there's something new created in dance hall because it is new and it is not it is not a familiar ground a lot of people always just say dance hall and mashup i personally think dance hall evolving you get me the only the only the only sad part about dance hall is like what kevin said there's less shows which we pray and wish more shows come back in dance hall but other than that dance hall is fun you just you party every night if something a mashup why are we partying seven days a week <laughs> that's what you call mashup they can't say that mashup i personally feel dance hall evolving a lot of us who are saying it mashing up is because we might don't like what is going on but dance hall is dance hall it is fun Dan- that's what i'm saying the dancing the dancing scene in jamaica turned up now because you have one zillion dancers you have dance you have this dance group you have that dance group you have this dance group and dancers are traveling the world right now and teaching dancers dancing so you have different different workshops all over the world by dancers dancers so like i said everything connect everything is evolving dancers the dancing scene in jamaica come on. if you want to learn something new jamaica is there and if you know if, if you can't reach a jamaica can't read the card come good you get me so the dancing scene in a jamaica and dance at jamaica <clears throat> and I mean, I think the sad thing of Craig saying, I think with the, with the fact of, um, you know, I mean, the, the, the internet and, you know, viral stuff on the internet, you know, YouTube, Instagram, those things help to, to bring it outside of Jamaica. And so what you realize is that a, a lot of dancers can survive you now, can make a living of, of, of dancing, not just you know creating a dance and it being in the dance and circuit in Jamaica but you can also go outside and export it you know what I mean whereas you have dancers going into Sweden, Japan and Russia you know what I mean so many places and, 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 um, and showing other people you know what I mean and making a living from it it has been you know i think it has sparked some form of creativity also in a lot of the, the, the dancers who had kind of you know rested it a little bit yes. and and now and also put some new new blood in the business who's you know eager fight so definitely dancing it's, it's on a rise again yeah, you know it's what huge, I mean? it's huge huge and i see that in japan dancing yeah. in japan is ridiculously huge and we are very happy to be um, a part of that world, pioneer, we are dancing and having fun and giving you the music to dance to. So, kudos to the Japanese dancers and the Jamaican yeah, dancers. People call every name and I'll go finish. But me have to talk about the greats. Them finna Mr. Waki. The great. Them finna Ice. And where them you do when you slide for your name and go and be something. Big up every dancer. Do you remember?